Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another edition of Wrestling News here on this channel. AEW Rampage, the first dance, brings in over 1.1 million fans for CM Punk debut. AEW delivered a historic episode for the company last week in Chicago. They packed the United Center for CM Punk's debut for the company and the show earned incredible buzz from even outside of the pro wrestling bubble. How did the viewership turn out? According to Solnomics, the August 20th special, the first dance episode of Rampage brought in 1,129,000 fans, 692,000 of those fans were in 18 to 49 demographic, giving them a 0.53 rating. The company also pulled in 107,900 viewers in Canada. 75,000 of those were in 25 to 40, 55 demographic. So WWE SmackDown on Fox Friday was watched by 2 million. 102,000 viewers total. AEW pulled in 740,000 viewers on August 13th for their first episode. They ranked number three in the night in cable behind two NFL preseason games. They pulled in a .31 in the COVID-19 18 to 49 demographic as well, we will have to see if CM Punk's participation with AEW will also cause viewership to spike for Dominate this week. He is slated to be on that show, and he will also wrestle Darby Allen at All Out. What's your take on this story? Sound it off in the comments below. You think that the views should have been way up more than it should have been because now that CM Punk is back, yes, I think it should be way up. But don't forget NFL preseason. I don't, nobody cares about that. It's not like they should be watching it anyways because of freaking it's preseason. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, hit the notification bell so that way you guys do not miss an upload here on this channel. I got more wrestling news all night for you guys coming right now and i'm out hey everybody it's your boy skiz here and if you don't subscribe to to Buan and the unstoppable denominator then you are a toothy bumfuck pussy ass bitch motherfucker